right, it's the anniversary. Let's clap for that again. Woo! All right. I hate the expression, I'm just like you. I put my pants on one leg at a time. Because it doesn't apply to everybody. Like for me, sometimes I wear tearaway pants, and I put my pants on one half of both legs at a time. <laughs> yeah. I like music, especially uh, classical, because it is a very sophisticated sound, and not a lot of people are really into that sort of thing. It's hard to get into, there's a lot to listen for, but if you are the kind of person that has the sophisticated ear and the poise to listen to classical music, but just hasn't yet, I like to recommend Mozart's Don Giovanni, or as it's more commonly known, ringtone number six. <laughs> I was reading in a science journal about an experiment performed by a 12th grade biology class uh, to test a plant's ability to sense sound waves. What they did was they took two plants, and the first one they played nothing but classical music for it. And that plant responded by growing stronger and healthier and flourishing. While the second plant, they played nothing but heavy metal. And that plant responded by shooting up half the students in second period. Wow. <laughs> crazy world we live in, I can't even understand it. I'm afraid of people because I think they're going to steal from me, especially at work. So I figured out how I can get around that, started putting mouse traps in my jacket pockets. That way, if anyone's going to try to steal from me, they reach into the pocket and the trap will snap right on their fingers. That's it, end of the story. The only downside being, if you have an expensive jacket, it tends to ruin it because the peanut butter sticks to the coat line. <laughs> I went to AA once because they were going to have a guest speaker, and it was the Fonz. When I went in and sat down, he said, Good evening, everyone. Welcome to A. A. <laughs> Alcoholics Anonymous is a very sophisticated organization. They have their own monetary system. Like, if you have five one dollar coins, that's equal to a five dollar bill. But if you're an AA and you have five one month sober coins, that's equal to one one month sober coin. <laughs> My ex-girlfriend had a lot of problems and I really cared about her, but I learned from the experience because even though, you know, she, she was anorexic, I'm just gonna say it, but she knew she had a problem and through hard work and plenty of determination, even she was able to lose five more pounds. <laughs> If I was in a dungeon, and the only thing they gave me to eat and drink was bread and water, I would just pretend that I was at the Outback Steakhouse. <laughs> <laughs> and that my food was just taking a really, really long time. <laughs> One time I was in a restaurant overseas, and um... The waiter knew I was a foreigner. I appreciated it because he told me, he said, I have to be honest with you, there's human meat in this food. And I was disgusted by that, but um, I said, you know, no thank you. I'm just going to have a salad. <laughs> the last time I went out to eat, I really wanted to order an appetizer, but there's so many different ones on the menu, I had no idea what to get. But then I saw they had an appetizer sampler that let you try two of everything. So I got that. And it was a great idea because when I was done eating it and my waiter came back and asked me if I was ready to order, I said, yes, I am. 
I'll have the mozzarella sticks. <laughs> <laughs> Happy anniversary, Travantain. Woo! Yeah. 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 Yeah.